Hey guys, what's up? It's Sarah at Rosie's Workshop. Uh, Rosie's Workshop is my new channel that I've got going on. Um, and the name of that comes from the fact that I'm a World War II reenactor. And I do a Rosie the Riveter-esque impression. Um, so, that being said, this is my very first Let's Play, so please go easy on me. Um, next thing I want to let you know is that I am using PS4 today. Uh, we're going to be playing Destiny. And if you hear any running water in the background, that is my fish tank that I have in the bedroom. So, also, any crazy background noise from the other room, I do apologize in advance. So, without further ado, um, let's see what trouble we can get into. I'm planning on starting from scratch with this. Hopefully something different. I have, as you can see, a hunter human male right now. Um, I kind of call him Collar. He's, he's pretty cool. I love him to death. He's level 22. I just got the legendary edition, so that way I have all of the expansion packs. A lot of fun. Great. So, here we go. Alright, you've got three classes in Destiny, for those of you who have never played before. Uh, Titan, and it says, you are an armored engine of war. Control any battle with strength and strategy. You have Striker, Defender, and Sunbreaker. Um, next is Hunter. You're a master of the frontier. Stalk and kill your enemies with ruthless precision. Gunslinger, Blade Dancer, and Night Stalker. This is the one that I play normally. Hunter, love it to death. Frickin' fantastic. I haven't tried any other classes yet. So, and finally, Warlock. The universe bends to your will, manipulate its energies to annihilate your foes. I usually compare these guys to different classes you might have run into in different RPGs. Um, so Warlock's obviously your mage, like look at that glowy hand. Um, or in Mass Effect terms, for those of you who are not the traditional kind of geek, or like sci-fi more, um, Biotics, kind of like Liara, I would think, or uh, Caden. Well, unless you played a Biotic Shepherd. Yeah. Um, Hunter... If you've played Guild Wars or anything like that, definitely, definitely just like a ranger, except you're wielding guns. Um, pretty much self-explanatory, the hunter is really, really awesome. Um, Titan is kind of like your fighter, with a little bit more oomph. Um, so, more like your soldier class from uh, Mass Effect. But definitely a little oomph. Um, something about Arclight. We'll see, we'll see. Um, I am contemplating a warlock right now. Um, let's see, Titan, warlock. You know what? Let's go warlock. Um, I'm gonna be doing a guy, as usual. Fun fact, I never really ever play females. I think only Dragon Age ever really done females before. So, oh god, no, not that haircut. Okay, so I'll just show you what options we've got here so I can actually get the awoken thing that I want. Um, human. You're human, hardy, and adaptable. Your ancestors rose from Earth to build an age of miracles. Uh, there's male and female. Um, you can customize whatever you want. That's the great thing about this. Awoken. You're awoken, marked by the cosmos. Your ancestors took shelter in deep space, and it changed them forever. Ah, there's the face I want. Awesome. Now, let's see if I can keep it there as I go through this. That's the female awoken. All right, now, XO. You are an EXO, a self-aware war machine built for a long-forgotten struggle. There's your male EXO, and your fi- Oh, jeez, I never really liked that face style on that one. Great thing is, customizations are always of- Oh, it did the thing again. Alright, hang on. There we go. I actually do like that whole face. Okay, it's the third face. Cool. I actually really like that. That's the first, like, random one that I actually decently like. Let's see. Blast it up. Oh, God. Okay. So the options for this... Ooh, that's nice. Ooh, ooh, okay. I like that one better than the teal, I think. Yeah, I guess the teal's a little bit harsh. Okay. Let's see here. Yes. You've got... Like, you could be bright purple if you wanted. Actually, let's make him a little bit more purple. Yeah, purple's always good. Yeah, you can go as light as that. Well, as, like, normal as that. Um, so this. But that's the default for this random generized thing here. Random, yeah. Generated, there we go, that's what I was looking for. Okay, cool. So, let's see. It's a little bit darker, a little bit more purple. Very purple. Not so purple. I like this purple. Because it's light. Um... 
lips. You got your color palettes here. I actually like the way that I, that is. For hair, it's this one, is it? Okay. You got shaved. That mop. That's not too bad. Eh. That's the straight up and down. That's a little over the top. Eh. Mm -hmm. Beatles bowl cut, anybody? Um, I think they're trying to get the Biebs thing going on. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Just a little bit. Whoosh. More whoosh. More whoosh. Okay, so the Awoken definitely more... Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. I don't mind that too much, but I do I do like this one. It's got the kind of David Bowie, Ziggy Stardust thing going on here. Just, just a little bit. I know he looks nothing like Ziggy Stardust, but bear with me. Um, okay, so, adjust myself around here, um, wonderful thing about pillows, so, also, I am using a headset, in case you hear any weird, like, scratching, whatnot, okay, I do apologize in advance, um, for those of you wondering what headset I have, um, because I'm on PS4, I got the Uncharted 4, uh, edition of the PlayStation uh, the Sony PlayStation Gold headset with the built-in microphone. So, anyways. So, I like this haircut for him. This is cool. Hair color. We can change this around. It's very pale. Blonde. Purple. Orange. Good grief. Blue. There's a pink. I hate pink. Absolutely hate pink. It's brown. Kind of don't want to do normal with him. Ooh. All right. Okay, that's kind of cool. That's very carrot toppy. No. Ooh, no. Oh, wow. So we have this, like, whole line here. So that's, that's what it looks in a lighter color. And if we do that versus that, I actually like this. That's actually really cool. And there's a green. No, no, I definitely like this one. Okay, cool. So, marking, here we go. So, we have this. That's what the one he came with. Around the eyes. Half of your face. Freckled. Tiger stripes. Football lines. It's the best way I can equate it. And, like, a tiger type thing, and the best way to see this is if you- oh my god, holy crap, that's kind of cool, is if you put it in like a darker color, or a contrasting color to the face, that way you can actually bring out the color of the markings, which that's actually- whoa, this is very, very cool. It's kind of wicked. I kind of like that. Let's see. Okay, so, here he is with no markings, kind of plain. It's like the, the winged eyeliner of Ra over here kind of deal. Um, it's the one he originally had. Mr. Sunken Eyes. The Bucky Barnes look, everybody. Um, nah, it's okay, I love Bucky, he's great. Uh, that's like a helmet type deal. I don't understand that one. Polka dots. Those are actually kind of cool. That's not too bad. And then you've got this, like, tiger face. Like, I have the, like, the skull one for my human male, and it's really awesome. But this is, this is really cool. So I think I'm gonna go with either this, this, or that. And I think, I actually really like those. Those are nice. So let me take a quick look here. It's rocking though. It's absolutely rocking. You know what? Let's be bold and daring. Let's do the the tiger face. Okay, cool. And that is that's literally that's how quick it is. It's just like race, gender, face, hair, marking, boom, done. But there's a ton of options. All right, let's do this thing.
Hopefully we can get through the first mission. Before my timer runs out. <laughs> if it does, I'll be sure to restart this. Oh boy. We called it The Traveler, and its arrival changed us forever. Great cities were built on Mars and Venus. Mercury became a garden world. Human lifespan tripled. It was a time of miracles. We stared out at the galaxy and knew that it was our destiny to walk in the light of other stars. But the Traveler had an enemy. A darkness which had hunted it for eons across the black gulfs of space. Centuries after our golden age began, this darkness found us. And that was the end of everything. But it was also a beginning. Okay, let's see where they're going to land us. I actually think I'm going to stop this first part right here. Um, I'll be back in one second for the next video. I'll see you then, guys. All right, thanks for watching.